This is Sheila Finkelstein with Technology for Seniors Made Easy.com. In this video and blog post below, I'm going to show you how to edit in Preview. Preview is the PDF program that comes with the Macintosh computer. I've had this iMac for almost three years and never realized I could edit in it. I was just annoyed because it wasn't Adobe PDF. And actually, I believe in Adobe PDF, you have to pay for a program to be editing the PDFs. So I am thrilled now that I have a Macintosh in preview. It was quite by accident. I happened to look up top and notice show toolbar in the top menu. Now what you have here is an image, a screenshot of another screensaver I have on my desktop. And it's this image that I've used in the, video, in the uh, post below. So when you open the toolbar, there's zoom, move, text, select, there's sidebar, there's more. But the thing that caught my eye is annotate. And clicking on the annotate, and let me see. And clicking on the annotate, you've got a bottom toolbar that has brings up here, it brings up a text box that you're undoubtedly used to, the text box with fonts that comes up when we're doing uh, typing on a web post or in a document, in email. And the real fun thing, one of the fun things, is the arrow link on the far left. Here's color. No, it's hard to see here, but there's a color. You can choose colors. I have red to make it easier. Now, in drawing the arrows, whatever direction you start in, the arrow will land up. The end of the arrow lands up at the bottom. So I'm showing on the toolbar, click view. Up here in real time is what I showed you was the uh, setting up showing the toolbar. Okay, uh, I just want to type. There's a little box here in the edit. I put my mouse in there. Get a teeny little bar here and I can start typing. Demo of editing preview. I click out of that. I can now move that anywhere I want. I'll put it up in the gray, can change color, but basically I wanted you to see this. So it's the arrow, the typing are the main things, and then you can change in that other box, you can change the font size, the type, etc. So, hope you too, if you have a Mac, get to use your preview PDF editing program. And full details and screenshots are further down below in this post. I'd love to hear what your experience of it, this is, if you've learned anything new and how it helped you. If so, please make notes in the reply at the bottom of the reply box at the bottom of this post. Thank you for visiting Sheila Finkelstein, technologyforseniorsmadeeasy.com slash blog.